Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment on this video saying I subscribed. Let's get into it. India is considering to buy several second-hand Mi-35 helicopters from other countries for the Afghan National Defense Security Forces. An Indian Defense Ministry team is also expected to travel to Serbia or Ukraine that still operates the helicopter. The Indian Army and the Indian Air Force have sent a request for proposal to Hindustan Aeronautics Limited for 15 light combat helicopters, thus making way for the production from 2018 onwards. HAL will manufacture the LCH from the new manufacturing facility. According to sources, the 155mm 52 caliber advanced towed artillery gun system, jointly developed by the DRDO and the private sector, will kick off the winter trials in the Sikkim sector. The government has disclosed that the procurement process of Sea Guardian unmanned aerial systems from United States has kicked off. The contract for 22 Sea Guardian drones will be worth approximately $2 billion. United Arab Emirates has shown interest in purchasing Astra for its Mirage fighters. Myanmar wants India to upgrade its T-72 tanks. Jordan is interested in buying the CAMF-226 helicopters, which will be built under India-Russia collaboration. Armenia is interested in purchasing radars, which are manufactured by the DRDO. The Defense Ministry had cleared the proposal to buy 83 Tejas fighter jets from Hindustan Aeronautics Limited. Out of the 83, 73 will be the upgraded version called the Mark 1A, and the remaining 10 will be the twin seat trainer version. Mark 1A variant will have 43 upgrades over the base variant. India and Russia have concluded agreements on the supply of S-400 air defense systems, construction of frigates, and the manufacture of CAM of 20060 helicopters. Russia's Deputy Prime Minister is visiting India on 23rd December for a high-level comprehensive review of Indo-Russian relations. A new gravitational wave detector is set to be built in India by 2025, in collaboration with universities from across the globe. The location for the new detector in India has been selected and the acquisition process has started. The Indian Navy deployed a submarine and the P-8I long-range maritime aircraft for a bilateral naval exercise with the Navy of Oman. The Indian Navy also deployed two naval ships, INS Trikand and INS Teg, for the exercise, while the Omani Navy deployed four ships for the sea phase of the exercise. The Central Industrial Security Force will take over the security of Brahmos Aerospace by April 2018.